All right, y'all. What's up? It's your boy, Let's Pray. I hope you're having a blessed and a prosperous day. Um, look here. Smash that like and subscribe button for your boy. I appreciate y'all uh, watching the videos. I told y'all I'm coming. I'm coming with the content, man. I'm trying to come with the content for Falcon Nation. If you haven't seen the last video, uh, got a laugh to keep from crying. Check that out on my Falcon Talk playlist. Um, this video, just a short video. But I hear some fans out here saying that Kyle Pitts is a bust. Is the young man a bust? Can you be a bust for you? Four games into the season? Isn't it a 17 game season right now? So we're not even really a quarter of the way through the season yet. And they already labeling this kid a bust. Let me say this. I was very leery of the um, lofty expectations they were uh, heaping upon this kid, man. They were saying, oh, he's going to be, he's going to change the position at tight end. He's better than Kelsey. He's better than uh, ooh, these other guys. Ertz, Waller. He's the proto prototype, the unicorn. He can't be guarded. Um, all this thing, yada, yada, yada. Highest tight end. The highest tight end has ever been picked in the NFL draft. I believe it was pick number four. We chose Kyle Pitts. Um, look, man. The comparisons for this kid and the expectations were just unfair from the beginning. I was saying that. You can't ex you can't call this man a Hall of Famer before you even see him in one regular season game? Come on, man. It's unfair. It's unfair to him. All the uh, buzz and all the expectations. Uh, basically putting the Hall of Fame jacket on him. Saying that he's the new breed of tight end. I'm not saying that he's not. I'm just saying, you can't determine whether he is or isn't after four games. It's just impossible, okay? Let him learn the offense first. He's still learning the offense. Everybody's still learning the offense. Matt Ryan's still learning it. Pitt's still learning it. Ridley's still learning it. He's running back still learning it. You got to give him a chance, man. Give him a chance. Um, he's been getting the ball a little more. Uh, he had some catches last game. Uh, we really haven't seen him break out and show that ability that you see on the tape uh, when he was at Florida. But, I mean, they really didn't throw him the ball the first two games. I think they only threw him the ball like three times. So, um, he just got to find his uh, niche. He got to find his niche in the offense. Matt Ryan has to find him and give him some more opportunities, some more targets. Can't be keying in on uh, Calvin Ridley so much, you know. Let let some other guys get that get those touches, man. Let some other guys get that ball. And I believe it'll actually open it up for Ridley more if we are uh, getting Pitts involved more. Um, I mean, Zacchaeus, I'm not really, I'm not a big fan of his, but you got to spread the ball around, man. Spread the ball around. Kyle Pitts is not a bust. Or is he? It's too early to determine. That's all I'm saying. Can't label him a bust yet. Let him get through one season. Let's see what we got after one season. Week 17, let's see what we got. Be easy on him, uh, Falcon Nation. Um, I mean, the team is not looking too good. We're one and three. Um, it's not his fault. It's not like he's just out there dropping the ball. Um, he's actually made some really nice, some really nice catches. A couple of really nice catches on tape already this season. Um, so, like I said, I think Matt just needs to find him. Stop keying in on Ridley so much and find this young kid. Uh, let him, get, you know, run and let him get the ball in some space and let him be able to do some things uh, with the ball in his hand. That's my opinion on it anyway. Um, let me know what you guys think. Is Kyle Pitts already considered a bust because he was picked so high and the expectations that he came in the league with? Or are you still giving him time, which you should? Um, I still think a young fella can be one of the best tight ends ever in the league. I mean, they're just saying he's just going to come in and just tear the league up. Just destroy DBs and safeties. What are, you, what are your thoughts, man? Kyle Pitts. Um, can you label him a bust? Uh, can you not label him a bust? Uh, what are your thoughts and impressions of him so far this season in four games? It's your boy, Let's Pray. Hope you're having a blessed and a prosperous day. It's Falcons Talk. All right, peace, y'all. I'm out.